In 2007, I Hate launched our flagship YouTube comment assistance system and helped to bring the level of discourse on YouTube to unprecedented new levels. But we haven't stopped there. Every day, people are being empowered to express themselves in new and ever more irritating ways. So today, we're proud to bring you our latest innovation. I Hate Facebook. If you're like most of the users on Facebook, you only created an account so that you could find pictures of girls that you used to have crushes on in high school. Of course, societal norms and standards of decency dictate that you also have to add a few of your actual acquaintances in order to create the illusion of a normal functioning social life. But some of your so-called friends may take this simple subterfuge too far, and actually start engaging in the various activities available on Facebook. Some of them will post incessant updates about the mind-numbing minutiae of their lives, others will upload dozens and dozens of party pictures which they photoshop their faces into and at the very bottom of the barrel are those people who will take endless quizzes about dull movies and play endless games involving ninjas and or pirates. And every time they do, the breaking news of their procrastination is piped directly into your busy life. You may have noticed that Facebook already supplies an extremely limited means to express your dissatisfaction at these unwanted intrusions. If you click the cross next to an item in your newsfeed, then if you're very lucky, you might possibly see less of that particular brand of nonsense in the future but that's hardly a sufficient resolution for the discerning Facebook user. Did you know that pressing the cross doesn't even inform the offending user about your valuable time that they've wasted? You need something more powerful. You need to add the I Hate Facebook application. Just follow the normal procedure for adding an application and accept the standard privacy conditions, and you'll be re-educating your Facebook friends within moments. As soon as you've added the application, you'll be returned to the standard newsfeed but you'll notice that the passive little cross has been replaced with a much more appropriate expression of your feelings. Clicking this will take you to the I Hate Retaliation screen, where you can customize the exact details of your response. Of course, I Hate Facebook comes complete with our patented SourceBot system, and with the full details of every aspect of your friend's life available on tap, it's never been easier to automatically find a perfectly caustic reply. We realize that unlike the far-off idiots making videos on YouTube, the people who you interact with on Facebook might actually be people with whom you have to interact with in real life. This unfortunately means that you might have to censor the full extent of your understandable hatred and rage. But don't worry, I Hate has you covered with a brand new feature. By activating this checkbox, you can add confusingly ambiguous nuances to your comments. The simple addition of a smiley symbol at the end of your diatribe will leave the recipient scratching their head trying to figure out whether your comment is supposed to be taken seriously or not. Their confusion will make them feel so foolish that they won't ever be able to mention your comment in conversation, but you can also be sure that they'll never make the same Facebook etiquette mistakes ever again.